I'm Fran Seaford with Stampendus, and I'm very excited to be here with Scrapbook Expo and to show you some fun new techniques and tips. And we're very delighted to introduce the House Mouse license to our range of products. And you can see them in the package. This is the first time that the cling rubber stamps have been available. So I like to point out that with our style, you separate them away from the acetate. That just gets it in the package, frankly. And this little cling decal is what is going to uh, help it attach to the block and that now gives you the design and you can see the design through the block to make your impression on the stamp on the paper and do your coloring. So I've got a really fun thing that I wanted to show here that's how we did all of the sparkle that you see in the background of the card and it's really very simple and I've taken some ivory paper and I have a sheet of our sticky panels which um, comes in the package like this. It's a double-sided adhesive. And I've applied a matching piece of the adhesive to the beige card. And getting a hold of that edge is the trickiest part. But once you get that pulled away, you release the liner that's on it. And I'm going to show you how easy and amazing it can be to take this and using our crystal halo glitter. This is a beautiful mix of different size, very sparkly glitter here. I'm just going to pour it across the sticky panel and it's going to fall all the way down covering the whole thing. And now you have a beautiful sparkle and sometimes I'll burnish that just a little bit. So I'm going to set this one aside and show you here how now you have this whole panel and it's amazing that you can now do other inking and stamping on top of the glitter. So I've started with the template that comes out of the large leaves package and I've got both the positive shape and the window shape. So you can see what I've started to do already on this card and I'll add some more so that you can actually see it. I'm going to hold the stencil down on top position where I might want to add another color. And I added some browns already. Now you're going to see me add the green. And it's as simple as dabbing it in. I'm using one of the little daubers here. And it's just amazing that it keeps all of the sparkle, but you can now see the pattern and even overlap your colors to create a beautiful backdrop of sparkly leaves. I'll lift it and check and see how it looks. It's looking very nice. So you can see you could combine any of those colors. You can overlap any of the different colors together. And when the sparkle comes through it all, it's just a beautiful backdrop that's much easier to do than it looks when you see the finished result. Because there's all of your sparkle and highlight. You almost hate to cover up the cards, so I hadn't glued these down and kind of move them around until you decide where it looks the best on your card. There we go. So thanks to Scrapbook Expo and the opportunity to show some other fun Stampendous products. Mm -hmm.